previously on The Amazing Race Canada. Good morning, Vietnam! Nine teams set out from Calgary, Alberta to Vietnam. At the airport, Steph and Kristen chose deception as their strategy. We don't have it. We, no, we don't have it. I swear to God, we don't have it. And told all nine teams they failed to get the express pass. We don't like to lie, but we think that this is the best course. And when teams touch down... So hot. The heat of Vietnam tested partnerships. Ah, I was just going to fall through it. Good job, honey. <laughs> with varied results. Damn it! Don't! Why don't you listen to me? Yes! I got no teamwork! Joe and Ashley danced their way to a first-place finish. Your team number one. <laughs> While rising temperatures were the downfall of Stefan and Antoine. What do you want to do? Take a penalty? Okay. Eliminating them from the race. Now, eight teams remain as they race to win choice of any one of these Chevrolet cars and trucks. A once-in-a-lifetime trip or two around the world with accommodations provided by Hotels.com. A quarter of a million dollars in cash and the Amazing Race Canada. of Southeast Asia is Vietnam. And in the southern reaches of this slender nation is the Mekong Delta. For the 17 million people living on this water world, everything revolves around the Mekong River. The starting point of the fourth leg on the Amazing Race Canada. <laughs> oh, God. Joel and Ashley won the last leg of the race and will depart first at 11.41 a.m. Make, Make your way. way by bus to Ho Chi Minh City. Teams must now find the local bus station and board public bus number three. And make their way from the peaceful town of Kai Bay to the cosmopolitan streets of Ho Chi Minh City. With over 8 million people and almost as many motorcycles, Ho Chi Minh City is the cultural center of modern Vietnam. All right, let's go. Let's so we're starting off from first. We need to go. You ready? We're going to do anything we can to, to stay ahead of the pack. We are off to Ho Chi Minh City. And it's hotter than a hoochie coochie. <laughs> Together, we're gonna kick some butt. Number three, bus. Yeah, this is it. Number yeah, three. Number three. Make your way by bus to Ho Chi Minh City. Okay. So it's the fourth leg, so this is the last opportunity Steph and I have to give away the Express Pass. Hi. We're keeping the Express Pass a secret because we want to minimize the target on our back. We're thinking about giving it to Frankie and Amy or Ann and Tanya. We just feel a connection with them, and we know when it comes down to it, we can beat them on a foot race. That's an impressive park job right there. Make your way by bus to Ho Chi Minh City. Okay, let's go. We are starting third. So we're going to Ho Chi Minh City. We feel like home being in the city because we love shopping. Thank you. Did this say number three? It's right here, this one. Yeah. will now travel over 100 kilometers on buses from Kai Bay to Ho Chi Minh City. Once they reach the Phung Trang and bus terminal, they'll navigate the busy streets of Ho Chi Minh City to find the Ba Tien Hao Temple and their next clue. Make your way by bus to Ho Chi Minh City. Okay, let's go. We're starting this leg in fourth place. Hi, get on her. But realistically, we want number one. It's a warm one. Evan and I are both super competitive. Come on, then. We may bicker, but it helps to push each other to win. Bus number three. All right, let's go. Let's go. Because my bus. You know, listen, when I read the clue, we haven't won anything yet. Yeah. If we could get first place, that would be amazing. It's got swimming in the river. Bus number three! Hey! Let's get it. Hey! Kai Bay, bus number three. Full steam ahead. Oh, the number three is just pulling away. Stop! Frankie and Amy right behind us. Woo! Go, go, go! No, we missed it. I hope that doesn't give us bad karma for the day in. Ho Chi Minh City. Bimo's here to help you have 1.5 million Vietnam dong on your cashback MasterCard for this leg of the race. Yeah. Ho Chi Minh City, here we go. Here we go. Cop in a taxi, then. Do you know where his temple is? Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay, let's go. We're heading to the Bati Ho Temple right now. There's a ton of traffic. Traffic is crazy here. People are just going all over the place. It's like stunt driving. Chaos. Who's that right here? Oh my god, yeah, yeah. Yes. There it is over there. Go ahead. Release the birds. Built in 1760 and regarded as one of the most sacred and oldest in Ho Chi Minh, this temple is a tribute to the mythical maritime goddess of Maju, the protector of travelers. 
In Vietnam, there is a ceremonial practice where people can liberate birds from cages. This is thought to release negative energy and bring them good luck. Teens pick cages and then release their birds to freedom. Once teens are feeling blessed and free, the bird merchant will give them their next clue. Okay, here we go. Hey, come on, guys. I just hate birds. Hey, you just had a cage. Where are the cage? Dude, I'm so scared. Stop yelling at me. Is this like the wings? It just like freaks me out. Come on, the birdie. Make your way to the corner of Lin Chi Thang and New Jin Thong and search for your next clue. Let's okay. go. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Okay, no, time to dilly dally. Does it say three? Yeah, number three. I really like that horn. I'd like to get that as a ringtone. Kai Bay? Kai Bay. We are in last place. We are going to try to move up to first place as hard as we can. We're going for number one. Go for number one, baby. The first two teams eliminated from the race were the only all-male team. Now we know at least a woman will win, and we're hoping for two women. Number three. Is there anybody in there? No. Right here. Okay, right here, right here. Roblox, who feels like a tool? With over four million motorcycles swarming the busy streets of Ho Chi Minh every day, this local garage stays very busy. In this roadblock, one team member will have to channel their inner mechanic. With these provided tools, instructions written in Vietnamese, and using this model as a reference, teams must correctly reassemble one of these scooters, being sure to use all the available pieces. Once the bike is fully assembled and ready to roll, this mechanic will give them their next clue. All done. Okay, Kristen's gonna do it. All right there. Take your time, babe. Do it right the first time. She's really good at this kind of stuff. For this roadblock, we put together this scooter to make sure that it's road ready, like the example that we have. For my 18th birthday, my dad got me a toolkit and said, since there's not going to be a man around, you got to learn how to use these. This one's for you, Dad. Mm. Okay. Roblox. Who feels like a tool? I do. Uh -huh. Dad, it. Right there, Dad. Yeah. Okay, come on. Let's go. Yeah. Okay, that's my... Oh, look at him go. Look at him go. Way to go, Dad. I always feel like a tool because I'm a mechanic, so... <laughs> I work on cars mostly. My dad's a mechanic. Oh, that's nice. Totally in my elements. I just gotta get it together quick. Get out of here first. Okay. This is totally not my thing. I don't even know what this is called. It looks so complicated. I have zero experience with tools. Oh, no! Stupid mistake! We're here? Oh, there it is right there. Okay, hey, Emmett's gonna take this one. What's up? This is my jam! Going on the farm, I always had bikes and I've taken everything off, putting it back together until finally it worked again, so this is right up my alley. Yeah, this is my thing! Look at that! Look at that! Here we go. Are you gonna check? No. Oh no, no, no. So it's a no-go. Um, I've got a couple of screws left. I'm just looking for anything I might be missing. Oh my god, I didn't even know this was here. Just found the instructions. I think I have to go back and fix something, which is frustrating. Just working on the last piece here. Okay, check. Okay, thank you. Awesome. I only charge you 100 bucks an hour. Just kidding. Bon appetit and enjoy a plate of local delicacies. Packed with thousands of patrons and roadside eateries, this entire city feels like one giant outdoor buffet. Teams must now make their way to District 1 and locate Asoy, a popular restaurant known for serving Vietnamese delicacies. Where teams will be presented with a plate piled high with fried crickets, centipedes, worms, and even a bat. Once they've gobbled up their entire main course, they'll be served with a very special dessert. A big, juicy coconut worm. One for each of them. Once they've crunched every last critter, they'll receive their next clue. Taxi, taxi, taxi. Let's do it. The next challenge involves desserts. I'm hoping cheesecake, but I don't think that's going to happen. It's getting really busy, eh, Tom? Yeah. We are on the last bus, and it is painfully slow. But we're never going to give up. We're not going to stop. You never know. You can do this. You're mechanical. Okay, what do I do now? 
now. Right here? Soy. We arrive at the restaurant and we have to down a plate of Vietnamese delicacies. We don't know what it's all about. Crickets, centipedes. centipedes, and worms. And there's a bat. <laughs> oh, it's gonna make me throw up. It out later. Looking at that is making me throw up. It's a nightmare. <laughs> I hate bugs so much. I hate bugs. I hate bugs. <laughs> oh, oh God, I can't eat that. I hate bugs. I hate bugs. I hate bugs. <laughs> oh, They're a little bit juicier. <laughs> Let's just get this over and done with, so I can move on with my life. You can do it, Ash. I'm doing it. It's nothing. Drink. Take a drink. We're <laughs> almost done, Ash. We're gonna have to eat this thing, but we're not eating bones or skulls. Sorry, buddy. <clears throat> oh, there it is. Who feels like a tool? I'm gonna do it. Wow. Where does the person even start with this? We both have to eat our own dessert. Have some water ready. Good. All good. Thank you. Thank you so much. Detour. Flip flop or V pop. When it comes to finding a party, there's no better place than downtown Ho Chi Minh. In this detour, teens will have to choose between one of two late night activities that will have them reaching for the stars. It's their call, Flip Flop or V-Pop. In Flip Flop, teens will need some serious eye-hand coordination to master the spirited art of flair bartending. With panoramic views, Ho Chi Minh's rooftop bars are rated as some of the best in the world. Teens will first locate Glow Sky Bar on the top floor of this office building. Once here, they will watch a demonstration from these professional bartenders. Then, they must recreate this high-flying routine exactly while correctly mixing Glow's signature cocktail, the Hello Vietnam. Once teams have correctly mixed their drinks with all the right moves, the head bartender will serve them their next clue. In V-Pop, teams will make their way to Kingdom Karaoke, take the stage, and channel their inner pop star! Karaoke bars all over the city are filled with locals singing their favorite songs. Once here, teams must use this phonetic guide to properly pronounce, memorize, and sing one verse each of this popular Vietnamese hymn. When the crowd feels like they're seeing stars, this fangirl will give them their next clue. Let's do the bartending. Flip flop. Let's go. Ugh, I'm so sick of my life. I feel sick because I, I know it's inside me right now. Ugh. Yeah? Ah, so I. Okay, so. Okay, perfect. Who's hungry? Good thing we didn't eat lunch. Oh, yeah. I was eating the bat. Okay, that's a bat. You gotta eat that. I mean, the bat. This is a mental thing. You just eat it. That's it. Get it into your head. Just go. There's not much meat on this little bugger. When I look into the bat's eyes, it gets way worse. So I'm gonna try to not look that way. We just gotta nail this. Glow sky bar. This is where we go up. Let's go. And here we go. The rooftop glow bar. The hottest club in Ho Chi Minh City. <laughs> All right, so we got to watch them. He like throws it. And catches it in the cup and he goes oh. like this, catches it. And he takes it out and he lets it kind of just roll down his arm. For this detour, we have to correctly perform a flair bartending routine. Toss. Shake. We've never done anything like this before. The difficult part is probably just the flipping of the... Flipping the bottle. You want to go try another station? <laughs> it's not easy being a bartender. <laughs>
express pass situation, we might have to change up who, who we're going to give it to purely based on who's there. and really hard. Okay, so people aren't here, right? No one's gonna come here. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is right here, it's right here. Oh, this is easy, only one. Chinese it's so much easier in Chinese yes. pronunciation. <laughs> Our strategy is to translate English pronunciation into Chinese characters to make it easy to memorize. Who's a valet? Kwang? Kwang? Still not confident myself in getting it. I'm just worried about screwing up, screwing up, screwing up, screwing up, and everyone else catching up. Well, we're gonna scrub the other thing too, Emmett. I know things are serious when Emma's like, Jill, we can't do this. Okay, we're gonna go, I guess. Get out of here. Stop! I think it's a good Let's decision. Go, we had such a good start to our day, like everything just seemed to be going right. Traffic's just crazy right now. It's like rush hour traffic. This may put us out of the race, you know.
just get Julie to scoot her along a little bit, one screw at a time. Hope she doesn't screw up. <laughs> Scooters tell me that everyone has been here except us. I'm trying to stay very calm. Don't stress, man. You can totally do this. Ready to be button Thank, Thank you. you. Emma and I want to go right back to the other place. You want to just try it? No. Here's the thing. We decided to leave the last detour. There's no leaving this one. Practice stations are over here, Emma. Is the girls out of here already? No, they're right there. Try. Throws it like this way, like he's up. You need more practice. This is practice here. Oh, here we go. Okay, got it. You're a Ho Chi Minh hottie. Kind sir. Inspection. Okay. Thank you so much. I did it in one take. So proud. You. It was like magic in my fingers. I really wish I you did that. You know what? I knew you could do it. Thank you, sir. Woo! Ah, karaoke's in the house. Let's see, Amy and Frankie, and we know immediately we have to go try their Niak. and locate City Hall. Inspired by Paris's Hotel de Ville, it's a reminder of Vietnam's French colonial history. Here in the center of the city, on this sprawling pedestrian boulevard, is the fourth pit stop on the Amazing Race Canada. The last team to check in here may be eliminated. Let's go. Yes! Yes! Okay, let's go. church, you know, singing karaoke. How hard can it be? Can we the way? Uno kwe? Uno kwe? I don't know. Keep practicing. That's not helping. Well, you not practicing isn't helping, so let's just focus. This smiling little sunshine face turns into Cranky Frankie. Oh my god. Uh, I hate this. Okay. Go Nelly Canelli. At least they're not alive. Bon appetit. This is a case of mind over matter. If you don't mind, it doesn't matter. Then the dessert comes. I was hoping for cake. So much sauce, so much sauce. Not bad. You did it. Okay. Detour, flip-flop or V-pop? We gotta do V-pop. V-pop. I like these karaoke things. And if they dress me up like a Vietnamese pop star, then all the better. Ooh, dress up. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> oh, I messed up. We gotta go back and mine. We definitely underestimated how long this would take. There's a lot more pressure at this point because Emmett and Jillian and Joel and Ashley are now making attempts. Oh. Ready? Yeah. Go. This is it. Mm -hmm. This is a detour that Kristen and I know that we can do. Shut it. And that if we just keep our minds to it and pay attention and work well together. A good looking drink right there. I think they got it. Good job. You did it. They did. Oh my God. Kristen and staff just walked out of here, so we're, we're feeling the pressure. We might be in first just because uh, Joel and Ashley had a significant lead on Kristen and Kelly. Unless yeah. Kelly and Kate smoked, smoked it, which, which they, they could have. Okay, we're just getting okay. here. Is this it? We gotta find John. He could be his own way. Hopefully he dropped us off at the right part. Kelly and Kate, ladies, 
your team number one. As the winners of this leg of the race, you have won a trip or two to Los Angeles, California, plus five nights accommodation provided by Hotels.com. You guys ever been to L.A. before? No, no, no. Shot there. Shot there. <laughs> Ladies, job well done today. See you at the next stop. Thank you. Take care. given away your express pass yet? I haven't had the opportunity to yet. We didn't see any other teams that we wanted to give it to. Who do you think you're going to give it to? Frankie and Amy. Perfect. When Frankie and Amy show up, I'm going to call you back to the mat. Sounds good. Thank, thank awesome. you. Thanks. We got to sing a song. We got to get this done. Hang on karaoke. Big step up right here. Julie and I have never done karaoke. And we're pretty good singers at home with the kids. It might be easier for you to start and you go second. Okay, we got this. Let's do it. because of how long we've been trying at this routine. Oh, can I do back? Oh, I messed up. <sighs> Rita and Yvette, your team number three. You did it. Oh, yes. Yes. You got a boot. Just as long as we're not the last team. I know yeah. we've been there all day. We were hoping we'd be like top two, but this thing really threw us off. Yeah. Go. Go. There's a really real thing here where we can't get it. I am sick to my stomach. Joe, yeah, we gotta start again. Oh, I got it that time. I messed up. Oh, Emmett. I'm sorry, Joe. It's starting to get me going. Part of this is like one of us gets it and the other one doesn't. I messed up. Sorry, the other one gets it and the other one doesn't. I messed up. We're both never going to get it together. Oh, I think we both messed up. We're going to keep trying. Just all we can do is keep trying. The hardest. All right, let's start one more time. Thank you. Come on. Upstairs. Oh, there we go. There is another team here. 
Killian and Emmett are here. You gotta stay in this game. So I look up, and Anne and Tanya are at the practice bar. Yeah. Come on, love, we can do this. We had a whole bunch of bugs. Well, we've really got nothing to lose. Let's just go try it. Let's try it. Oh, boys. There are people. but we're dancing. I'm sure it doesn't look awesome, but we're having fun. Yeah. For these guys, we're not going to get eliminated. Nope. Slow down, hon. You're scaring me like you're making me feel panicked. All right. The only thing we know, if we leave before these guys, we're not going to get eliminated. So the pressure's on. You did it. Good luck, guys. Good luck, guys. Let's go. We gotta get in a cab and be sensible. We're just wanting to get to the pit stop, and we don't want to get lost like we did last time we were on our way to the pit stop. And we turn it, and then we shake it. One, two, three, four. There okay? Go. Voila. That was some good blood ending. You free? Okay. Fast, fast, fast. Thank you. We did it. We're done. We're gonna go see John. Yep. And uh, we'll let fate play it out. Hey, Emmett, let's just go. Emmett! Yeah? Is this it? Ask these guys right here. Do you guys know where this place is? Emmett. They don't know. They don't know. Okay. Emmett, oh. where do you want to find this? Come on, Ton. We can do this. Come on. Just run, Ton. I'm ready. Emmett, stay with close. Come on. Jill, it's right there. Jillian and Emmett, you two are team number... Seven. Right. How do you feel about that, you guys? Ah, uh, the tough one. It was a really, really, really hard one for us, so we're just happy we're still in the game. Emmett never stopped once. Emmett was so positive the whole time, so thank you, Emmett. We're not going home. We're not going home. Julian and Emmett, see you at the next stop. Thank, thank you. you. Team to arrive. I'm sorry to tell you this, but you have been eliminated from the race. Are you proud of yourselves? We just, you know, we gave it our all. We did. I did this with my best friend of 36 years, who I tried to beat up in junior <laughs> kindergarten. We're super proud, and we know our families will be really proud of us. Yeah. yeah. The whole point of this for us is to show our kids, try and try again, and never give up. You guys are lucky to have each other. You've got a beautiful attitude. You've got a beautiful friendship. Thanks. Sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't, but if you don't put yourself out there, you'll never know. Ladies, 
All the best. Thank you. Thank you. We get to see our kids. We get to see our kids. We're super excited. <laughs> We're super excited about. Next time on the Amazing Race Canada. <laughs> Teens return to Canada and discover the islands of Haida Gwaii. This is gorgeous. Where ancient tales test teens' listening skills. The beaver. That's wrong. Oh, my God. I thought this was going to be easier. Pressure soars to new heights. Ah, wait, oh, wait. Come on, Mom. Go, go, go. And a log jam causes teens to lose control. We're just not getting this. I mean, my cough that's the race. Previously on The Amazing Race Canada. Nine teams set out from Calgary, Alberta to Vietnam. At the airport, Steph and Kristen chose deception as their strategy. We don't have it. We, no, we don't have it. Swear to God, swear to God we, we don't have it. And told all nine teams they failed to get the express pass. We don't like to lie, but we think that this is the best course. And when teams touch down... so hot. The heat of Vietnam tested partnerships. Ah, I was just going to fall through it. Good job, honey. <laughs> with varied results. Damn it! Dance their way to a first place finish. Your team number one. <laughs> While rising temperatures were the downfall of Stefan and Antoine. What do you want to do? Take a penalty? Okay. Eliminating them from the race. Now, eight teams remain as they race to win. A choice of any one of these Chevrolet cars and trucks. A once in a lifetime trip for two around the world with accommodations provided by Hotels.com. A quarter of a million dollars in cash and the amazing Race Canada. of Southeast Asia is Vietnam. And in the southern reaches of this slender nation is the Mekong Delta. For the 17 million people living on this water world, everything revolves around the Mekong River. The starting point of the fourth leg of the Amazing Race Canada. Yes. Oh, God. Joel and Ashley won the last leg of the race and will depart first at 11.41 a.m. Make, Make your way. way by bus to Ho Chi Minh City. Teams must now find the local bus station and board public bus number three and make their way from the peaceful town of Kai Bay to the cosmopolitan streets of Ho Chi Minh City. With over 8 million people and almost as many motorcycles, Ho Chi Minh City is the cultural center of modern Vietnam. All right, let's go. Let's try. So we're starting off from first. We need to go. You ready? We're going to do anything we can to, to stay ahead of the pack. We are off to Ho Chi Minh City. And it's hotter than a hoochie coochie. <laughs> Together, we're gonna kick some butt. Number three, bus. Yeah, this is it. Number yeah, three. Number three. Make your way by bus to Ho Chi Minh City. Okay. So it's the fourth leg, so this is the last opportunity Steph and I have to give away the express pass. Hi. We're keeping the express pass a secret because we want to minimize the target on our back. We're thinking about giving it to Frankie and Amy or Ann and Tanya. We just feel a connection with them, and we know when it comes down to it, we can beat them on a foot race. That's an impressive park job right there. Make your way by bus to Ho Chi Minh City. Okay, let's go. We are starting third. So we're going to Ho Chi Minh City. We feel like home being in the city because we love shopping. Thank you. Did this say number three? He's right here, this one. Yay! Woohoo! Oh, she made it! now travel over 100 kilometers on buses from Kai Bay to Ho Chi Minh City. Once they reach the Phung Trang and bus terminal, they'll navigate the busy streets of Ho Chi Minh City to find the Ba Tien Hao Temple and their next clue. Make your way by bus to Ho Chi Minh City. Okay, let's go. We're starting this leg in fourth place. Hi, get on her. But realistically, we want number one. It's a warm one. Evan and I are both super competitive. Come on, then. We may bicker, but it helps to push each other to win. Bus number three! Alright, let's go. Let's go. How are we gonna get there? Just by bus. You know, this is when I read the clue. We don't want anything yet. Yeah. We could get first place. That would be amazing. It's got swimming in the river. Bus number three. Hey. Let's get it. Hey. Kai Bay, bus number three. Full steam ahead. Oh, the number three is just pulling away. Stop. Frankie and Amy right behind us. Woo, go, go, go. No, we missed it. I hope that doesn't give us bad karma for the day in. Ho Chi Minh City. Bimo's here to help you have 1.5 million Vietnam dong on your cashback MasterCard for this leg of the race. Yeah. Ho Chi Minh City, here we come. Yeah. 
Cages. This is thought to release negative energy and bring them good luck. Teams must pick cages and then release their birds to freedom. Once teams are feeling blessed and free, the bird merchant will give them their next clue. Okay, here we go. Hey, come on, guys. Correctly reassemble one of these scooters, being sure to use all the available pieces. Once the bike is fully assembled and ready to roll, this mechanic will give them their next clue. I'll do it. Okay, Kristen's gonna do it. All right, there. Take your time, babe. Do it right the first time. She's really good at this kind of stuff. For this roadblock, we put together this scooter to make sure that it's road ready, like the example that we have. For my 18th birthday, my dad got me a toolkit and said, since there's not gonna be a man around, you gotta learn how to use these. This one's for you, Dad. Who feels like a tool? I do. Uh, I'll do it. Right there, Dad. Yeah. Okay, come on. Let's go. Okay, oh, look at him go. Look at him go. Way to go, Dad. I always feel like a tool because I'm a mechanic, so... <laughs> I work on cars mostly. My dad's a mechanic. Oh, well, that's nice. Totally in my element. I just got to get it together quick. Get out of here first. Okay. It looks so complicated. I have zero experience with tools. Oh, no! Stupid mistake! We're here? Yeah, oh, there it is right there. Hey, I'm just gonna take this one. What's up? All right. This is my jam. Going on the farm, I always had bikes, and I've taken everything off, putting it back together until it finally worked again, so this is right up my alley. Yeah, this is my thing. Look at that. Look at that. Here we go. So it's a no-go. Um, I've got a couple of screws left. I'm just looking for anything I might be missing. Oh my god, I didn't even know this was here. Just found the instructions. I think I have to go back and fix something, which is frustrating. Just working on the last piece here. Okay, check. Okay, thank you. Awesome. I only charge you 100 bucks an hour. Just kidding. Bon appetit and enjoy a plate of local delicacies. Packed with thousands of patrons and roadside eateries, this entire city feels like one giant outdoor buffet. Teams must now make their way to District 1 and locate Asoy, a popular restaurant known for serving Vietnamese delicacies. Where teams will be presented with a plate piled high with fried crickets, centipedes, worms, and even a bat. Once they've gobbled up their entire main course, they'll be served with a very special dessert. A big, juicy coconut worm. One for each of them. Once they've crunched every last critter, they'll receive their next clue. Taxi, taxi, taxi. Let's do it. The next challenge involves desserts. I'm hoping cheesecake, but I don't think that's going to happen. It's getting really busy, eh, Tom? Yeah. 
We are on the last bus and it is painfully slow. But we're never going to give up. We're not going to stop. You never know. and we have to down a plate of Vietnamese delicacies. We don't know what it's all about. Oh, God, I can't eat that. It's disgusting. Cricket, centipedes. Centipedes and worms. And there's a bat. Oh, it's going to make you throw up. Looking at that is making me throw up. It's a nightmare. Juice, a little bit juicier. Let's just get this over and done with so I can move on with my life. You can do it, Ash. I'm doing it. It's nothing. Drink, take a drink. 